so over leveled for this area now, man. We're way too good. But you know, I was thinking, shouldn't this just place be become a fort or something like that? Like maybe we didn't have the ability to make forts because we cleared out this area when we were still in Haven. But still, maybe we can check it out. Check it out to see if we can make it into a fortress for us now. I highly doubt we can because there's no indication you can do that. But still, it seems like it would be a fortress type place. But it never let us, you know, do it. Let's check it out. See if we can do this. I'll look around in the castle see if there's any indication of us of it letting us do this. Yeah, we have to put up the Inquisition flag. Grand Forest Villa. There's a little landmark, but I don't think this is... I mean, this probably isn't a place where we can, you know, do it, but still, I want to check it out. Huh. Yeah, up there, isn't that a place? No, I guess not. Hmm. Climb all the way up there? No. Is that the flag? No, it's not the flag. It's a tribuchet or whatever the heck they call it. Yeah, this is a tribuchet. I don't think we can make a fort from this place. Although I think you would. Right? It looks like a place you would be able to do that. I guess not, though. Yep, I guess not. I don't know. Might as well go back down. Oh, shit. Ah, eh, we're okay. We're okay. We're still okay. Alright. Call my mounts here. There we go. Let's do the uh, Venatory quest that's around here. Then we'll go ahead and do finish up uh, the Dorian family thing or whatever. Or we could do the Varric thing. Yeah, let's do the Varric thing since we're here in the area. Might as well. Here, I think. Yeah, it's up there. Snipe them just like we did with Varric. Completely own them. Where are they? I think we got him. <laughs> yeah, we owned him. Oh crap, he's got that red lyrium bow. The red lyrium stuff that we add to it for, for an upgrade for him. Sweet. Oh, we own those guys. Tell me, Cassandra, did your family throw suitors at you? <laughs> She's asking about her family problems. Until I broke one's arm. Then there were fewer. I must admit I never tried that. Uh. It was an accident. Well, mostly an accident. Asking her asking her about his, about family troubles. Because he has some too. <laughs> How many points do I have now that I can spend? I have three. Damn. I want to... Oh, I didn't want to do that. But damn, I want to figure out how to be a Templar so I can start putting points into that. Because that seems pretty good. That Wrath of Heaven was... That seems pretty good for, like, area of effect. And that'd be good because I don't have that many... I'm more better for, like, fighting single people. You know what I mean? And tanking. I'm not that great of a 
multi fighter or whatever. I don't have that many area effects attacks like uh Varric or you know like a rogue or um what was it? oh crap bear but uh, like a rogue or a mage so that'd be good to have that. Just bear. They're completely owning this bear. Oh, this poor bear. Oh my. <laughs> got completely burnt alive holy crap look at that <coughs> he got completely burnt alive where the heck am i going am i going the right way yeah i'm going right there. look at this this is rare rare stuff christy grace there we go i don't think it does a times five or times four with uh rare things oh well <laughs> I like the the title of Varric's quest. Well, shit. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. We already got the keys and everything here. I'm assuming this quest was would have been the place where you when you would have been like, oh, I gotta find the key and all this stuff. But we can do it right now. All right. Oh, our gate. Here we go. Let's go in here. Going back down. We cleared out all the dark spawn from here, so there shouldn't be any enemies. There might be Carta enemies, the dwarf guys, but I highly I don't think so. Hmm. Cutscene. Finally. I started to think you weren't coming. Nobody said you had to hang out in the creepy cave while you waited. Well, I did wait, so let's make this quick. These idiots are carrying the Red Lyria Mountain unprotected containers. Oh. We don't want to stick around long enough for to start. Yeah, Red Templars are here. Why, sh why should they be protected? Why would the containers need to be protected? Lyrium is incredibly dangerous in its raw form. It can poison or kill dwarves, and we're resistant to it. Sometimes it just explodes. No warning. <laughs> Basically, only crazy people mine lyrium. The mining cast doesn't just sling it into a bucket. It's carried in special containers that keep it under control. And that's normal lyrium. The red stuff is worse. I wouldn't be surprised if most of their miners die just digging it up. Hmm. You know what red lyrium does? You seem to know more about the effects of red lyrium than most. Varric told me plenty about what it did to him and his brother. How did you find this place? How did you find this operation in the first place? There must be hundreds of deep roads entrances. I've used this entrance in the past. Varric's not the only surface dwarf to explore the deep roads. Oh, I've got to admit, I was pretty surprised when I came here and found it full of humans. All right, I hope you know how to fight. If you're coming with us, I hope you can handle a fight. No, I thought I'd cower helplessly while you do all the work. Huh? He's a decent shot. Decent? You want me to admit you're better than me in front of the Inquisitor? Let's not waste any more time. She's shall better we? than him? Huh. Huh? She's got a bow and arrow. She doesn't have a crossbow. Alright, let's do this. 